Hi everyone, good morning. Today I'm going to present Bogart's Orchard and Farm. This is part one of visiting apple orchards in northwestern Maryland. Bogart's is a family owned farm. Since 1904, this farm has been an active or working farm producing fruits and vegetables. When Edward Bogart's parents died in 1930s, he and his wife, Romaine, purchased interest of their parents' farming business from their siblings. Due to their frugal nature and having competitive business skills, they survived the Great Depression of 1930s. Edward and Romaine died in 1984 and 2006 respectively. Alan Boger, son of Edward, took charge of the orchard business and started expanding it from 1950s to 1990s. Alan Boger manages large business projects while enjoying his partial retirement. His wife, sister and children are involved in the farming and business operation. From 2017 Census of Agriculture, I note that orchards in Maryland covered about 4,200 acres of land and were owed 23.7 million US dollars, which include apples, about 2,000 acres of land. In 2018, about 39.6 million pounds of apples were harvested. Nearly 300 farms have agricultural tourism and recreational services. My tour was a structured one called Pick Your Own Fruit. After buying a ticket and a bag, I along with other visitors onboarded a trolley connected with a tractor engine. There are six to eight benches on the trolley. Each bench accommodates four persons. I took shots from the trolley as well as from the field or the garden. It was a fun with other visitors, mostly children and grandchildren. I present the videos to you in the sequence of the trip. It was an amazing experience for me. Picking apples was a real fun. I saw happy and contented faces of the kids and their escorts. There it goes. Enjoy the journey. All the shoot was done by my new GoPro Hero 9 a very tiny action camera used to capture events on the go. Hope you will enjoy the virtual tour and some beautiful pictures that I try to capture through the lens of the camera. On some occasions, I did try to narrate the scenes, but the microphone was not good enough to record my voice. Sorry about that. I tried to experiment with the mic. In these scenes, we were watching from the tractor trolley and enjoying the vast area of the orchards that we did not visit. Please continue watching. Please keep watching. What a beautiful garden! Very tart can also be used for applesauce, and it'll be this row. And you'll notice there's a name tag underneath, so you can. That's the Our way guide which explains rich. the rule so of engagement, in the front of it what also. to do, Any what row not to do, just means that the perimeter. On that and that uh, there's food on that row, and that it's ripe for us to pick today. It's ready. And when you guys are picking, just try to use two hands, lift and twist. Don't yank it. Don't pull. We don't want to waste any uh, apples. And then you'll see there's a yellow ribbon down there. Just don't go past that area. That means anything past that point is not ready for us yet. And when you guys are done, the benches are to my right. Make sure you end up at the end of the line. It looks like cozy. Yeah.
now it is my turn to see and touch the beautiful apple trees and the apples. It was simply amazing. In this clip, you can hear sounds of other visitors talking while picking apples. I was trying to capture the pictures of the apples. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, green. Colors. This is some sight, so we can do a good picture here. This is different. You see, these colors are different. This is like pink lady. Sure, you are watching with me. My first peak.
my second pick. My third pick. My fourth pick. My fifth pick. Another pick. The company claims that Bulgars is a 600 acre farm and it is one of the largest orchards in Maryland. Another pick.
If you like this video, please press like button. We need your support to grow. Please consider pressing subscribe button. Please stay healthy and be happy.